Fashion Lab shocks Nigerians review those who will take over Nigeria if Tinubu is not sworn in. Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. The Southeast governors finally showed off the long-awaited Second Niger Bridge in recent days. Even though President Muhammad Buhari is leaving office in a few days, they choose to name it after him. This is meant to show respect for what the former president is thought to have done. But the Minister of Works and Housing and the former Governor of Lagos State, Babatunde Fashola, have said they did not think people in the Southeast appreciate what the President and his government have done for them. Fashola said that the Southeast cannot deny that President Muhammad Buhari and his government have made good changes in their area. Using feedback from many different sources, he emphasized that the former government had made good progress in terms of infrastructure. He also talks about a study that shows a big drop in travel time, which shows that transportation was becoming more efficient. He said the North will take over this country. If Tinubu is not sworn in as president on May 29, this is exactly what Babatunde Fashola said. He added, I often feel like this ministry is hard to evaluate, but I think the feedback we get from the people we have clearly encourages us and shows that things have changed for the better. Once we started, since we started, for example, the Southeast can't say that Buhari hasn't left behind a message of change on the roads. It now takes less time to get somewhere. The study of road travel times shows that on average 55% less time is spent on the road. Babatunde Fashola, who is leaving his job as Minister of Works and Housing, says that comment from Nigerians shows that President Mohamed Buhari's government has made the country better. In an interview with China, China's television on Friday night, Fashola said that the 2015 theme of change was carried out by the Buhari government. After eight years as Nigerian's president, Buhari is likely to leave office on May 29. Fashola said that most of the stolen funds recovered by the previous government were used for building projects. He also said that fighting corruption is not just about arresting and jailing suspects. I tell people that this fight against crime is not just about putting people in jail. It is not just about giving up money. Either it is also what you decide to do with the money you stole, he added. When asked what he would do if Bola Tinubu's new government kept him kept him on, Fashola said that it was extremely hypocritical that he would be one of the next ministers and that it was time to give young people a chance. Hmm. See, talking about infrastructure, well, President Muhammad Buhari tried, but we should not be saying, saying it as if they did, they 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 are doing good for for us as Nigerians. This is their job. Building bridge, uh, constructing bridges, uh, building bridges, constructing roads, and all that. Uh, medical health centers, uh, schools. You are not doing any good to an individual or a region. 
We just have to tell ourselves the truth. Why is it that any time government do something in a region or whatever, people, these politicians want to take it like, eh, we, have done, we have done good for you. This is your duty. This is what you're supposed to do. You know they do any good for anybody. That is the truth. You are not doing any good for anybody. It's just because our politicians, they don't, they don't do all these things. So when they do it, it will look like you get one good when they do for anybody. This is what you're supposed to do. As a government, you're supposed to build bridges. As a government, you're supposed to uh, construct roads. As a government, you're supposed to, you know, build health centers, schools. Make life beautiful for the masses because that is why we were there. Or that is why you were there. So coming, coming back to tell us that uh, this government have done well for you. No government have done something like that for you. We are the government that do this and that and all that. Me, I know, me, I know that, that one. I, I don't understand. You get us to do me for, for my body. You not do any good for anybody. That is your duty, your responsibility as a government, your responsibilities as a government to the masses. You not take hold when you enter the office. You not talk say so you go build the road. You go, you go, you go construct roads. You not talk say so you go build bridges by saying that you will make life easier, better for the masses. So when you do all these things, why are you taking it like you've done a great, a great job for people? This is your duty as a government. Nigerians, this country have a long way to go. Because why they do this, why they say all these things, these people, once they are being thrown into office, everything they are thinking about is how to embezzle money. When they don't do one thing like this, they begin to praise themselves. If they praise yourself for duty, what are you supposed to do? Why are you there? Why are you there as a president? Why are you there as a governor, as a minister, as a commissioner, as a local government chairman? Why are you there? Is it not to oversee, you know, the affairs of the people? So why come in to tell me that you've done this uh, for the good for the people of this, uh, the, you have done you well and all this? I beg. That one, get us, get us to do me for you. Someone said they're yeah, useless fashioner. What is second bridge? To compare road construction going everywhere in Southwest. Okay. Second bridge, good luck. Jonathan paid 95% of the works before leaving office anyway. So go and verify or ask Jonathan. He will tell you more about it. With this, your character and the wickedness of Southeast and South South is better that the Northerners should take over. Okay. Okay, guys, these are some reactions from Nigerians. What's your take on this? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you for this coming out here. Bye for now.